one of our uh, students. Uh, she is a Filipino domestic worker uh, living in Hong Kong um, and suffering from a lot of marginalization, not only because her work is very demanding uh, and is low paid, but also that they are not seen as equal uh, citizens in Hong Kong. Uh, but through photography, she was really able to uh, realize her talent uh, and her creativity. And last year, she got a National Geographic Award. Hi, I'm Bonnie Chu. Um, I'm the CEO of Lensational, and I joined uh, Resolution Project as a fellow through the World Model United Nations Conference in Australia back in March 2013. Lensational seeks to address the issue of gender inequality. So by providing uh, cameras and photography training to marginalised women and girls, uh, it gives them a platform to be telling their stories, particularly those that cannot read and write. Uh, and globally, two thirds of the world's illiterate population are women, and that amounts to 520 million women who can't read and write. But photography as a universal language transcends culture and language barriers, allowing these really important voices to be heard to be influencing global development. Three weeks before I got the resolution grant, I just set up the Facebook page at for Lensational. So this is, uh, since getting the grant, it was very much defining the beginning of our journey. Um, and it's been five years and now we have worked with over 800 women and girls in 21 countries in Asia and Africa. Uh, and it's a very much a bottom-up movement driven by volunteers across the world, uh, mainly uh, young people who are looking to bring this idea into their respective countries. Uh, but it's not just about the individual lives that we have touched, uh, which is of course really important, but I think we have really been able to build this movement uh, of, of this movement of people committed to driving social change and committed to realizing gender equality.